Okay, folks, I know there's going to be a little bit of talking over here and there, but I did not film an intro for this, as this is the same morning as my last one. So hopefully you guys enjoy, and I'll stop talking, and we can get back to the fishing. Thank you. Rainbow. Nice fish here. I have to fix my net. Good fighter though, that's for sure. Come on in, come on in, come on in. There we go, we got his head up. As soon as you get their head up, usually you can surf them. I believe that's the right term. Hooks out of him. Nice big fish here. All right, readjusted the crap out of my net. So it shouldn't be a pain in the butt to get. I don't know why, but it just got all tangled somehow in the walking. So we uh, straightened her out and went from there. So once again, as you move up in a stream, you wanna fish the close water to you, then you want to fish the middle water, then you want to fish the far water. So we just finished fishing from the basically the end of my pole tip all the way across, and we're going to go to the next portion. So that way you're continuously introducing to new fish, um, and hopefully you have a better chance of catching more of them that way. So see I went from the close to the middle of the pool. And I got a fish. Another rainbow here. Much smaller rainbow than the last one. Really cute little fish. Little, whoop! Easy there, bud. Tell the trout to stop flopping. He's going to tell you to fly a kite. Now we'll go to the far side of the stream here. Actually, you know, you, I probably should, with as much water's there, I probably should split it into four pieces. Um, I just missed one. Not sure how I didn't get him, but. That one I didn't miss him on. Good fish here. Really a good fighter. I say I thought he was gonna be a brown, and he was brown. Or I thought he was gonna be a small rainbow, but turns out to be a nice sized brown. God, is he a tube. Something you usually don't see is browns that filled out here. That is a nice chunky fish. 